Thanks to the close collaboration between FIG and OpenAI, humanoid robot Figure 01 can now think independently and communicate with people in real time. During tests, the Android demonstrated the ability to recognize speech, answer questions, reason, and follow human commands all at the same time. For instance, the robot listed items in front of it, and when asked if it could eat anything from the list, it handed the only edible item on the table, an apple. Hey, figure one, what do you see right now? I see a red apple on a plate in the center of the table, a drying rack with cups and a plate, and you standing nearby with your hand on the table. Great, can I have something to eat? Sure thing. It then explained its action logically and simultaneously executed the command to clean up the trash laid out in front of it. On it. So I gave you the apple because it's the only uh, edible item I could provide you with from the table. According to developers, no one controlled the robot during the test and the video was filmed in real time. Unlike the previous robots, the wheeled humanoid from the Reflex Robotics startup isn't accustomed to pondering the meaning of existence. It's created with one purpose, to swiftly and precisely execute commands as successfully demonstrated at the ModX exhibition in Atlanta. The unique demonstration involved fulfilling visitors' requests of asking the machine to fetch various snacks from shelves. With wheels, arms, and multiple sensors, the robot can promptly reach the desired item and deliver it to the requester. Currently, the humanoid is remotely operated. However, engineers are already working on making it fully autonomous. IronLev made a breakthrough in magnetic levitation train technology by successfully testing their prototype on existing railway tracks. Their prototype traveled 1.2 miles autonomously, reaching speeds of up to 43 miles per hour. One of the main advantages of such transportation is that it doesn't require the construction of new railway tracks, significantly reducing project deployment costs. Additionally, thanks to special technology, these trains don't need constant electricity for levitation, further avoiding additional expenses involved in setting up new infrastructure. It's expected that in the future, these trains will weigh around 20 tons and reach speeds of up to 124 miles per hour. The main drawback of drones is their limited autonomous operating time. Engineers proposed an original solution to this problem using urban transportation as relay stations for quadcopters. On these stations, drones can rest when not assigned to a task, thus conserving battery power. A special system was developed for safe landing on the roofs of vehicles, allowing drones to land on moving transport. Auto carriers will have a special QR code on their roof, enabling drones to quickly locate nearby vehicles and land. The system has already undergone initial testing and proved its effectiveness even in dark conditions. One such carrier could be the Chinese electric car Zeger 007, whose headlights can display various messages. The owner simply needs to write a message on a tablet inside the car, and the smart vehicle will display it on its headlights. Water wheels have been actively used for various purposes since ancient times, even in ancient China. The company ORPC decided to revisit this idea and harness the power of water flow to generate electricity. As a pilot project, they installed the RivGen platform in the Canadian province of Manitoba. This system looks like a catamaran consisting of two pontoons with two turbine-like water wheels placed between them. When the pontoons fill with water, the entire structure sinks to the bottom and the wheels, driven by the water flow, rotate the generator rotor, producing electricity. For maintenance, water is pumped out of the pontoons and the structure is lifted to the surface. Unlike diesel generators, this system doesn't require fuel and consequently doesn't emit CO2 into the atmosphere. 
The Chinese company Limex Dynamics amazed the world by showcasing the abilities of their bipedal robot P1. The machine underwent tests in extreme conditions on the peak of Mount Tanlan in Shanghai. During the trials, the device adeptly navigated and overcame obstacles in an environment unfamiliar to it. The robot walked on soil, grass, sand, and a thick layer of fallen leaves, climbed steep slopes with large boulders and small stones, and crossed a deep trench. Additionally, the device underwent extra stability tests. It was pushed, pulled, and even struck with a stick. Despite these trials, the machine managed to maintain its balance and demonstrated its ability to quickly adapt to various situations. Americans are going to build the longest airplane in the world. At least, that's what Radia Company claims, as they shared plans for their unique aircraft called Windrunner. The length of this aircraft will be 356 feet, which is 106 feet longer than the current record holder, the Boeing 747-8. The plane's payload capacity will be 80 tons and its main purpose will be transporting wind turbine blades to remote areas. Despite its impressive size, the aircraft will be able to take off and land on dirt runways as short as 6,000 feet. For comparison, a Boeing requires a concrete runway of at least 10,800 feet. As for the realization of such a massive project, the company claims they can build the aircraft in just four years. Austrian company Smart Flower Energy Technology has introduced the world's first mobile solar power station made of carbon fiber. This setup weighs about 400 pounds and can be set up in just 10 minutes. Moreover, thanks to the use of composite materials, the power station cannot be detected by modern radar systems. This feature allows for safe use during military operations to power communication devices and other critical equipment. As for the technical specifications of the system, according to the developers, such a setup is 40% more efficient than similarly sized stationary solar panels and can operate in both desert conditions and in snowy mountains. Very soon, NASA will send a message to extraterrestrial intelligence. The Europa Clipper spacecraft was chosen as the Messenger, which will deliver a plate with information about humans and Earth to Jupiter's moon Europa. The plate is made of tantalum metal and measures 7 by 11 inches. On its inner surface, there is an engraved poem titled In Praise of Mystery, A Poem for Europe, along with a silicon microchip containing data about 2.6 million people. On the outer side, there are audio recordings of the word water in 103 languages from around the world. These recordings were converted into visual representations of sound waves and engraved on the plate. It is planned that the spacecraft with the message will reach its destination by 2030. The first patient with a Neuralink brain implant continues to amaze. Recently, he demonstrated how skillfully he can move chess pieces on the screen using only the power of his mind. Now it's been revealed that the patient is already doing great at Mario Kart and competes on equal terms with his father. Additionally, he's gradually practicing his skills in the more complex game Civilization VI. According to the paralyzed young man, the chip's operation is akin to the magical force from Star Wars. Just think, and the character on the screen starts moving. Engineer David Vukovic has unveiled his latest innovative creation, an electric hydrofoil watercraft called the Flyway. Unlike other similar devices, this craft has a paddle, not a jet propulsion, and is designed to be ridden while standing. The main distinctive feature of the hydrofoil is its underwater wings onto which it settles after reaching a certain speed. This design allows the craft to rise above the water surface, significantly reducing resistance and enabling it to achieve higher speeds with the same power. Additionally, reducing friction on the water surface helps conserve battery power, which is also crucial for electric vehicles. The technical specifications of the hydrofoil are currently kept secret but hopefully we'll share them with you soon. Have you ever seen flying milk jugs? We're pretty sure you haven't. 
but soon residents of Sweden will be able to witness such a sight. The food delivery service Foodora Air is launching a pilot project where drones shaped like old milk jugs will serve as delivery agents. Like regular drones, these quadcopters will be equipped with a system of propellers. However, their main feature is their body. It's a scaled-down replica of the containers milkmen used to deliver their products to customers. The payload capacity of the drone will be 9 pounds, and it will be able to fly up to 7.5 miles on a single charge. SwitchBot has introduced a new smart lock that offers 15 different ways to unlock, from a regular key to fingerprint recognition or voice recognition. It can be installed on almost any door and it's easy to do it yourself with just a few basic tools. On the outside, there is a screen with a digital keypad and a fingerprint sensor. The lock can be connected to a smart home system and it's also easy to unlock using your smartphone or smartwatch. The lock operates on regular batteries for up to 9 months. To protect against virtual threats, the system uses reliable encryption methods to ensure that no one can break into your home. This unusual yacht, resembling a torpedo, is one of the fastest in the world. It has set the world speed sailing record 120 km per hour. Yet, Vesta Sail Rocket 2 doesn't use fuel to glide on water. Its sole source of energy is the wind captured by high-tech sails. The problem with boats that reach high speeds is that the water passing through their wings turns into vapor. This causes a loss of speed and increases the risk of accidents. To avoid this, the boat has a secret weapon. Specially designed wings help it reach high speeds and resist cavitation at high speeds, ensuring stability and safety. At the London Arms Exhibition, an unmanned ground vehicle was unveiled capable of transporting and releasing swarming munitions with artificial intelligence. Such a vehicle can carry 21 cruise missiles. The system can determine how many drones need to be launched to hit a specific target based on its characteristics and size. Swarming munitions spread rapidly and can change the methods of armed forces attacks. Artificial intelligence helps drones interact with each other and coordinate their flights without direct operator involvement. This significantly increases their accuracy in attacks. Drones can also be used for reconnaissance and monitoring of the enemy. They are launched from a special launch pad and can fly at an altitude of up to 1,600 feet for 45 minutes. NVIDIA has created the world's most powerful chip for artificial intelligence. The new graphics processor has 208 billion transistors. According to the developers, it previously took 8,000 Hopper graphics processors and 15 megawatts of power to train an artificial intelligence model with 1.8 trillion parameters. With a new chip, only 2,000 graphics processors are needed to solve such a task, consuming just 4 megawatts. Giants like Amazon, Google, Microsoft, and Oracle have already shown interest in the new chips and are ready to use them in cloud servers. A Czech inventor has created an electric motorcycle with a fully enclosed cabin. It can carry two passengers and reach speeds of up to 150 miles per hour. The cabin's durability and egg-shaped design, along with the multi-point safety belt, ensure maximum safety for the driver and passenger. Good visibility is provided by front and side windows. For maximum stability at low speeds and during stops, the motorcycle is equipped with two side wheels that automatically deploy at the press of a button. Therefore, there's no need to use your legs like on regular motorcycles. In addition to the passenger seat, there's also a luggage compartment. Inside, the cabin features comfortable leather seats, a high-quality audio system, and as an additional feature, a remote-controlled door. The motorcycle has a range of 248 miles, but an additional battery can be installed for longer trips. This enclosed Velomobile is designed for racing competitions and record-breaking speeds. Thanks to its streamlined shape, it manages to minimize wind resistance during rides. The enclosed cabin provides additional safety and is designed to provide comfort for the cyclist during long periods of riding. 
the cyclist can comfortably rest their head on a supportive surface. The seat has the largest contact area with the driver, allowing for comfortable riding without putting strain on the spine. Additionally, the driver has a good view of the road, although at first glance it may seem challenging to observe the road from the cabin. For this reason, mirrors are installed on the body so as to have a good view of the rear. Despite its size, the bike is impressively lightweight, weighing only 53 pounds. The innovative Station Air Drone falls somewhere between professional military drones and ordinary civilian drones. Its fuselage is made of carbon cells ensuring high body strength. It is equipped with dual counter-rotating propellers and is powered by a kerosene turbine. The drone can be equipped with a high-resolution camera and is relatively easy to transport and deploy on any terrain. Additionally, designers have worked on its appearance. It has a modern anesthetic body, distinguishing it from other similar devices. It can be used for various civilian and professional purposes. The package includes a convenient portable pilot remote control with easy operation. Earthling is a modern electric boat for leisure on the water. It operates on a system of lithium batteries. With a full charge, the boat can boast a range of up to 46 miles at slow speeds. Solar panels can fully charge the battery in about three days. Additionally, the engines produce minimal noise, ensuring a comfortable ride. The boat's hull is constructed from composite foam with carbon fiber inserts, and the boat is equipped with a modern intelligent control system. Inside, there is plenty of space to accommodate up to 14 people simultaneously. There's comfortable furniture and even a kitchen surface. It can also accommodate a jet ski or other equipment for swimming and entertainment. Tensile has unveiled a new tent that can be pitched on the ground, suspended from a tree or even set up on water. This tent can accommodate up to five adults along with their gear. It offers a floor area of 100 square feet, making it the largest in the company's lineup. The universe serves as a four-season shelter with an insulated floor. When used as a raft, it can hold up to three people. With a special hatch in the floor, it can even be used for fishing. Such a tent will be indispensable for outdoor enthusiasts. This adorable unmanned delivery truck is designed to deliver groceries. In addition to delivering groceries, the R3 can be equipped as a mobile snack bar or a store without a driver and cashier. When a customer chooses an item, cameras follow them as they take it and add it to their basket so they can make payment. The delivery robot is equipped with 360-degree cameras, radars, thermal imagers, and optical cameras. With the help of artificial intelligence, the data obtained is processed instantly for quick and safe delivery of goods. The fully electric vehicle has a range of up to 100 miles. Additionally, the vehicle is equipped with external airbags for pedestrians in case someone suddenly jumps in front of the unmanned vehicle. Which invention did you like the most? Comment below! Don't forget to subscribe to our channel so you don't miss the next videos, where we will inform you about new inventions and innovations that are mind-blowing.